Good morning, good morning. Welcome to 4 by 8 Paper Stuff. This is Beth. We are in The Art of Noticing by Tiny Tim and Ebenezer Scrooge. Because I have no more ideas in my head for foundation practicing experiments, and until my Allie Edwards journal comes, this is my project. So I thought I would do another one of her projects, Stay in the Mind Frame of Ebenezer Scrooge and Tiny Tim from A Christmas Carol, which is what my December Daily is going to be. Because... And yes, I'm at the beach, and yes, I'm in shadows, and yes, I'm sorry, and yes, I can't do anything about it, and yes, ugh, sorry. I'm in a different room because of my leg, which is a shattered ankle, and I can't get upstairs, which is in the other room, which is better lighting. I'm next to a window. I'm trying my best. I'm so sorry. So, the vow I took with myself and YouTube is to try to put something ugly out of some of the boxes and paper stuff that I have here from last year, December daily, and um, turn it into something better and justify to myself why I didn't throw the piece of paper away last year. So this piece of paper on the left, not the Santa hats, that's from something else, is a collage that I did, and it's got weird concert ads in it and weird paper and just all kinds of stuff makes absolutely no sense color wise anything but the paper on the right that one is vellum painted with watercolor and I did that last year and I love that and it might happen again this year again in December daily so I'm trying to work with that paper on the left and turn it into something prettier <sighs> I only have watercolor here and markers I have a few acrylics but not really anything to do anything with. Um, I'm only going to be here for a few days, so I didn't drag a lot of stuff back down here to the beach, and um, we're at our beach house right now. So I wrote on top of here, what did I put? High voices or loud voices? Noisy voices. I wrote noisy voices with black very haphazardly. This is Ebenezer Scrooge's definition of Christmas carols. And he said, nope, I'm sorry, this was Tiny Tim's. This is Tiny Tim's. Nope, this is Tiny Tim's version of the children playing in the snow. Yesterday we did Ebenezer Scrooge in the snow. This is Tiny Tim's version of the children playing in the snow. And I wrote on there, Happy voices is what I did. Happy voices. Sorry, I had the book in front of me now. And yes, I'm behind a little bit. The giggles, the happy shouts of boys and girls my age and other ages make me smile. I love waking up from a short nap and seeing them play outside my window. One day I'll be out there playing and giggling with them. That's Tiny Tim's take on children playing in the snow. Now, yesterday, Ebenezer Scrooge said, As I cross the street to go to the office, the snow is slick and I better not fall. Why are all these children playing in the cold on my street? Can't they go somewhere else? So see, it's going to be kind of that. Um, good versus bad. Mean versus not mean. Grumpy versus happy. Make the best of what you have, uh, which is kind of like what Tiny Tim always does. What I'm trying to do this year with journaling <laughs> with a leg that's all messed up. Um, what I'm doing here is stamping, and I took some vellum that had washi tape on it that I ripped off from somewhere yesterday. And I wrote on here, I put the cut the circles out of the vellum with washi tape. I stamped in red, and then I put the picture of the carolers. And Tiny Tim's little box on the left hand side said, listen to those beautiful voices. I wish I could sing like that. And then Tiny Tim's journaling is the little girl on the end has the softest, sharpest singing voice. She opens her mouth and the beautiful sound comes out effortlessly. If only I could do that. And that is Tiny Tim's take on caroling. And I added some uh, outlines with markers around. I don't like that line stuff, but that's what Allie Edwards does, so I'm doing it. I added some markers to jazz up this little bit here. Um, the vellum with the washi tape is something I would have thrown away. Uh, it was on the edge of that vellum that I painted on. And I saved it because I can't throw anything away. So I cut circles. Well, they're not really circles. They're kind of like splotches to go with the red splotches from that ink pad, ink stamp. 
then I put red and green dots and some little music notes here and there. And that was fun. A lot of fun. And just, this is simple. Simple, simple, simple. But it's more about the noticing and the, the journaling of the noticing. I think is how Allie Edwards describes it and prefers to focus on. And her notebook had all of these like journaling spots already inked on. She had a little place for the picture up top. She had the box for the journaling. I do not. I'm just using a different Carlos notebook. So the carolers, this is um, Ebenezer Scrooge's take on carolers. The racket is unbearable. I'm trying to eat my supper. Their voices make my digestion impossible. What makes them come to my door every day? And then the little journaling spot at the top, rather than a picture this time, in black, of course, I put, what is that racket? Why must those people sing under my window? And I didn't have a picture for carolers for him, and I didn't want to do the same picture, and I didn't want to do the same thing. But now the picture um, on the left is actual that collage paper that I cut it down. It's got a concert notification on it. It's from the paper around here, um, a modern group, which obviously is not going to be appropriate for um, – Tiny Tim and Bob Cratchit and Ebenezer Scrooge and everybody else in the Christmas Carol. But it was ugly, and I wanted to make it work. And I put music paper on top of it, color it covering salt and pepper, so you can't tell that this is a 80s group coming back, or 90s group, whenever they were, to Columbia for a concert. This was pre-COVID. And then I, I took black marker and did a couple little music notes sporadically around and on the music paper itself I wrote noise 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 because that's what um, Ebenezer Scrooge declares it as so again the art of noticing by Tiny Tim and Ebenezer Scrooge making ugly things into pretty things making good and or bad into good making grumpy into happy so thanks for watching see you all tomorrow I won't do two pages tomorrow I'll just do one of each, but I was trying to catch up and be even for today. So thanks for watching. Bye.